Good evening, friendos. It's time for a quest for semi-glory. We're back to Receiver 2 tonight. Uh, starting tonight with this, I think, um, we're going to violate the traditional spirit uh, of quest for semi-glory a little bit. Um, we're going to continue to work on Receiver 2 here. We're going to try our best to, you know, get the five tapes and rank up or whatever. Uh, when and or if we get to the point where, I mean, I guess we're already at that point. Whenever we rank down uh, by taking a death, I think we're just going to skip ahead back to the back to the rank we just lost because um, I don't know. I got I got shit to do, and I can't be dealing with just ranking down for taking either an unjustified or a justified death. Really, so we're just gonna we're just gonna rank right back up and then continue along uh, when certainly when we take a death instead of trying to claw our way back all the dang time. So. Uh, that way, we continue to make progress. Uh, we still have fun doing it, um, instead of just continually banging our heads against you know these various walls or whatever. So, you know, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's uh, let's collect the tapes. Uh, let's learn about more receiver lore, and then unlock more guns and and, and have fun with the game uh, instead of just getting frustrated by it. That seems like a a pretty rational approach, I will say. So here we are. Here we are in receiver two. Still. Doing the things. Doing the things. Receiving the things, I guess. Um, can we get here from here? Yeah, probably. Ah, and I also also received a hint earlier that uh, simply shooting the tapes as they are counts as uh, absorbing them in full. It does. That's curious. Um, we probably won't do too much of that unless we really start getting repeats over and over and over again. Um, because I think they're, they're kind of, you know, fun and, fun and good to listen to. Really, uh, kind of part of the whole aesthetic, right? So we're just gonna... We're gonna continue to listen to them normally, I think. I just wanted to see if that actually worked as advertised. And it does. Humans are curious creatures, always hungry for information. The threat has found a way to turn this strength into a fatal into a weakness. Fatal weakness. Right. They force-feed us from a fire hose of narratives designed to agitate and demoralize us, leaving our minds exhausted and crowding out our own thoughts. They divide the world, false dichotomies, and we demand we choose between obvious lies. To become a receiver, you must reject this choice. Alright, so we got two of five already. That's a pretty good start. Haven't really rushed into anything unnecessarily. Haven't done a bad just yet. The night is still very, very young. Plenty of, plenty of time to do a bad. But we will not be doing bads. We will not intentionally be doing bads. We only intend to do goods here. That means collecting more tapes without getting a bullet in our head. from around this corner. Oh, yep, like from around this corner. Good, excellent. That's kind of what we wanted it to do. As they're making it still this difficult to just hack it, since it's still <laughs> knocked over. <laughs> and uh, on its and missing its little ammo reserve thing. But yeah, I think we did a, go a good job last time of adjusting where we were shooting. So we're going to continue to do that and just kind of probably try to be more patient with when we uh, run around corners and shit. Because this game is actually rather unique in the uh, in the realm of shooters that I've played in that it uh, it really does punish you for rushing a lot, uh, so we've got to not rush so much. 
That's the whole deal here. Oh, jeez, I didn't even see that one normally there. One tool used by the threat is called anti-pattern. The threat cultivates an atmosphere of terror and anxiety around trivial risks, providing a suitable environment for them to inject fixes for these non-problems. Invariably, <laughs> fixes for these non-problems. New issues. That, that sounds like my job on a daily basis. <laughs> no, that's not true. By that's not true. I fix worthwhile and the valuable things. Locked most in a times. hopeless state, with no clear path forward. We have developed a mind to detect people trapped in this anti-pattern. Like a hall of mirrors, this construct is based on mm. illusions and is easily Some shattered. Imagine that you have changed your mind about something you would never doubt. Act like you believe this new truth for an hour, a day, a week. Is there Do something up there that we didn't more sense. spy before? This is the feeling be a, a... of breaking free. Loading something or other up there, right? Now, nah, whatever. It ain't bothering us. We ain't gonna bother it for now. Oh, well, isn't that clever? They put a thing over there. How in the heck am I supposed to get that? Like so, I guess. <laughs> Very dangerous. There we go. I don't know what that is. That's a little secret, secrety thing. Uh, oh, here, there's one that we didn't, uh, didn't, didn't read. Uh, contact. Somebody reads your missives. Yada yada. yada. So somebody, some folks are passing notes between themselves. I guess that's good. That's probably good in this weird ass dystopia, right? Just pass notes. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how it managed to take itself out there, but we're gonna go with it. Shit. Just woke this one up somehow. I don't know how exactly, but just by being in range of it. And there was that fucking drone that scared the shit out of us. Whew, but we made it through. We made it through. And it I guess it eventually okay, we blew out its bottom thing. We blew out its bottom thing, or or its top one, whichever, and then it slowly lost altitude and crashed, so, okay. But in the meantime, we had to run around a bunch and not get hit by either it or the uh, the other turret that was around there. That was kind of, it was a little frightening, a little scary. We made it through. Um, okay, yeah, there is a... There was one. There we go. <laughs> I was just like, hmm, can I get this dude? I'm glad I did. Take our time, and we don't need to do any fancy jumping around, possibly falling. It's just kind of laying on the ground, that's weird. 
Or is that the one we shot out of the sky? That might have been it. Yeah, looks like it was. Neat. Put that out of its misery so it doesn't scare us later. Ooh. Nope. Shit. <laughs> Gotta give up eventually, right? Eventually. Fuck. <laughs> fuck! Fuck, 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 Oh, I don't want to run that way, though. Okay. Okay. There. <laughs> I was just, like, waiting. I wanted to give myself a nice... A nice long corridor to work with there. Oof. Oh, come on. Did it really just hard crash? I think it did. Yep, awesome. Cool. Well, glad to know that uh, when I do try to take my time, I get punished for it. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> Fucking awesome. Okay. I mean, it didn't crash crash, but... Um... I'm gonna need it to do something. Here we go. Kill this thing off and try again. Good gravy receiver, too. Can't just let me do my thing, can ya? Nope. Well, damn it. I. Mm, I don't think that's gonna save my spot, is it? I think that's going to dump me back the zero tapes in that section, isn't it? Isn't it, isn't it? Well, certainly it will. Uh, yep, back to zero tapes. Son of a bitch. Oh. Gosh dang it. All right, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Okay, and it didn't kick me back to... Well, actually, maybe it did. This looks pretty familiar. If this is going to be stopped up over here, then we are in pretty much the same area. Okay. Oh, fudge. So there's going to be a thing over there, and there's going to be a sleeping one somewhere, too. With the rise of powerful concealed weapons like the Detective Special, along came laws to restrict them. In the 1930s, the NRA drafted and endorsed concealed carry restrictions that passed in almost every state. Starting in the 70s, they changed their mind and started aggressively campaigning to repeal those same laws. Until now, concealed carry is permitted in most parts of the USA. They still vary widely from state to state, so if you want to concealed carry, it's a good idea here, right? to learn the uh, laws where you live. Just one or two. They're probably different than you expect. It's also important to learn the laws about when it's legal to use concealed weapons in self-defense. Now, they say it's better to be tried by 12 than carry by 6. But that can be cold comfort when you're doing hard time for murder or manslaughter. Before choosing to concealed carry, you need to, at the very least, understand the five pillars of self-defense. Innocence, imminence, mm -hmm. reasonableness, avoidance, and proportionality. Okay. I don't remember there being a turret in this place here. Only so you if you did must have changed just attack, a tiny, tiny bit. The attack was clearly imminent. There was a reasonable threat of injury or death. You did everything you could to avoid the threat. 
and you used the minimum possible amount of force in proportion to the threat. One tool used by the threat is called the anti-pattern. The threat cultivates an atmosphere of terror and anxiety around trivial risks, providing a suitable environment for them to inject fixes for these non-problems. Invariably, the actual purpose of these solutions is to create new issues that were worse than the initial situation. By associating the search for solutions with new <laughs> problems, so the mind actually becomes locked in a hopeless state. Didn't actually with no destroy clear itself. Path that. forward. We have developed a mind <laughs> tech for people trapped in this anti-pattern, like a hall of mirrors. This construct is based on illusions and is easily shattered. Imagine that you have changed your mind about something you would never doubt. Act like you believe this new truth for an hour. A day, a week. Mm. Do things it's make sleeping more sense? Oh shit. <laughs> shit! 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 What the? Okay, I backed up to get out of sight, and apparently it still could see me. <laughs> God damn it! All right, well, you know what that means. We're skipping ahead because not dealing, not dealing with working our way back up. Not doing it. Ain't got time for that. <sighs> okay. I don't know that we've exactly burned through all of the, uh, shit. We've burned through all the different variations of the tapes at this rank, so we're not gonna just bypass all of them just yet. I'm sure it's actually under the damn thing, because why wouldn't it be? Because why wouldn't it be? Yeah, Each like that. receiver will train for mind tech. This oh my god. as a checklist and ready in mind for action. Rogers. It allows you to break from a reactive cycle caused by outside influence and allows you to regain control. Like all mind tech, your core is a sequence of thoughts. Where are you? What is your age? What is today's date? What is your firearm? Mm. Then take a deep breath and listen. Definitely giving me more darker rooms, I think. <clears throat> it's usually these were at least partially lit up where I could toddle through them without having to whip out the old flashlight, but I think maybe they're getting wise to my non use of it. Boy. Okay, I don't know how that failed to fucking knock out the camera there. Felt like a pretty strong broadside. Thank you. The threat exists beyond this world. In this reality, they are weak. Their actions are limited. With great effort, they have infiltrated dreams, implanting ideas, 
but it is humans who have nurtured Ooh. these ideas, causing them to grow and spread. For these people who were already compromised and who have nurtured these damaging thoughts, there is okay. no. Oh hope. my! God. <laughs> Excuse me. As Over there, one down like there. To reach out to them to help them, we must first focus inward on ourselves. <laughs> For us, there is still some hope. We must focus all our energy off this on last catching one there. this yeah. small chance. When exposed to these contaminated yeah. thoughts, remember there not to be reactive. <laughs> I'm not gonna hurt myself Instead, on purpose. <laughs> oh, jeez! I say that. <laughs> Activate I say that, and then I unholster too quickly. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Oops, oops, oops. It helps to put a damn safety on these revolvers. Oof. Okay, we're dealing with at least one flyer, maybe more. Camera all fucked up for that shot. All right, deal with that. It's the flying around though it makes me nervous. It makes me nervous. Maybe we should just knock it out of the sky and be done with it. <laughs> Things just up there. All right. Uh. Well, that didn't do what I wanted it to. All right, maybe we just leave it then. Maybe we just leave it. <laughs> oh, could have just used the door. Oops. There's one over there. Okay. Oh no, we couldn't have just used the door because that's all blocked off. Did we get anything for that? We didn't. No tape, no bullets. Uh, where did we bust in here? Ew. Jesus. I need to get the one bullet out of its chamber there. Come on. Turn around. Turn around. Or did we actually hit the camera on it too? Oh no, here we go. Oh no, it fell over. Haha. <laughs> Even better. Even better. I did my best. Uh oh. I know uh, it doesn't seem like uh -oh. it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. I really did. Just in case. I, I, I think it's uh, one of those. Hope you believe me. Oh. Is it one of those? <laughs> I tried and tried and it is. tried. It is. Oh, okay. Look away. <laughs> nothing, <laughs> Look away. It's getting heavy worked. again. And you all hate me. I did empty everything Maybe. out. Maybe. Okay, good. Maybe I deserve it. Oof. I always, always Leave it try. It. Hmm. Not this time. Not this time. There. All good. There's one down below as well, or is that <clears throat> just the one we're messing with here? Okay, that's just that one. Good, 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 good. Ooh, that's twisted. Ooh, it's over to the right. 
There's one over on the right, and I think there's a turret down below. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Uh, oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Ay! Ay! Shit! <laughs> run, 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 run! Ooh, okay, we're gonna backtrack a little bit. Oh, shit. Still after me, huh? Alright. Turn and fight. Turn and fight. <laughs> Woo! Boy. Ye gods! That's always very scary. <laughs> hey, Tormod. Thanks for the resub. Much appreciate. Much appreciate. Much appreciate. Okay, that was a little scary because my aim is not the greatest when I'm running away like a big old coward. So I'm glad we got rid of that. Oh. Whew. All right. No problem. No problem. No problem. Oh. Still one over there, huh? Got its back to me now. Guess what? Oh, is this the one we were fucking with before? Yeah. All right. That. Time for it to go. <laughs> trouble on this again. No. No no tape. Not even a little bit of ammo. That stinks. Mm. Oh, oh, what the fudge? Um I'm pretty sure I didn't press that sequence of buttons. <laughs> Damn it. Well. Whatever. We're not we're not dealing with the D ranks anymore. We're we're just gonna go right back ahead. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Alright, well, fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Man, after all the work we put in, I ended up just jumping over a railing, which I'm pretty sure I didn't press the button to do, but I guess I did. Deal with this with only. Oh, or tape. Tape is good too. To progress in mind tech is to become Ooh, fudge. of your own thoughts. Okay. Eventually, each that, thought will become that. clear and distinct. Solid, incredibly dense but irregularly shaped. When combined with other specific thoughts in the right pattern, they will Ooh, fit into much. place, forming a solid wall of defense. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's a little scary, too. Hey, Omega Oven. How you doing? Good to see you. <clears throat> Good gravy. Had some close calls and some blunders already tonight. Um, but I think ultimately we're sort of learning. Just a little tiny bit. A little tiny bit of learning as a treat. <laughs> Oy. Okay. Is there anything else back over here, like a ladder or something? No. Hmm. Not be that particular segment. Oh, there. Look at this. What the? Did I not? Oh, I did chamber sound. There we go. There. <laughs> 
God, come on, <laughs> son of a bitch. I guess the other option I had there was to just rush forward behind the crates. But I did not think fast enough to do that. the world record run for this oh hey look at that i think it crashed again wow two crashes in 30 minutes does not a good look make receiver two amazing amazing <sighs> well i mean at this rate i'm not gonna have to quit it every 40 minutes to get it out of powerpoint mode so i guess that's something hmm <sighs> Better not spawn me back with a revolver again. Like, come on, at least give me a semi-auto for my troubles, right? Okay, good. <sighs> running on Windows right now? I am not. I'm actually running in Linux. And this is a native Linux build, too. This isn't even through Proton or anything. So I'd expect it to be less cranky than it apparently is. didn't have to select a Proton version for it, so this should be the native version. Why it's having such a gosh dang time trying to keep itself running is beyond me, honestly. Oh yeah, absolutely. If I was running this in, in Proton or Wine or something, I would 100% accept the blame for it. Like, that is my MO whenever I run shit in Proton, really. It's just like, okay, it doesn't run perfectly, whatever. That's the trade-off I make. That's the trade-off I make for not running it natively, right? But this is this is a native build, so it's like it doesn't even have that excuse. It's not like I'm playing it on a potato machine either. Like should be uh should be clean and clear and good to go. Boy howdy, I guess it just doesn't want me playing it. Stressing because it's a fun ass game. When I'm not getting constantly shot full of holes. Fudge. Fudge. Like so. Like so. your friend makes a joke about hurting themselves, it might just be that. A joke. Nah, that shit's not... Or, <laughs> it might be their last cry for help before they are okay, killed by the there. flood. Get them alone later, ask about it, and really listen to their answer. It's probably nothing, but in this case, it's, okay. it's so much better to have ten false positives than one false negative. Oof. Oh boy, alright. That's a precariously placed turret. We're not dealing with this. Okay. Oh, come on, that counted for fall damage? That was like fucking two feet. I guess we did land kind of awkwardly on that garbage bin, so maybe that was it, but still, come on. Give me a little credit here, game. Okay, one down there. 
Oh, hey, look at that. Unrestricted magazine. <clears throat> Hidden second one around here, is there? Okay, good. It's not like these levels are difficult individually on their own, right? <clears throat> it's not like collecting five tapes in one go is supremely hard. I'm just an idiot most times. I'll, I'll rush around a corner before clearing it and end up with, you know, three rounds in my chest or something. Or I'll make uh, a bit of a misplaced step over, an, over a ledge and then that'll be the end of it just speaks to my necessity of being slow and careful but not too careful like a moderate amount of careful that's what we need to be Everything in moderation after all. One of right? the most common pistol malfunctions is known as the stovepipe or failure to eject. <sighs> so called because it looks like a stovepipe is sticking out of the side of the gun. This usually happens when the shooter is not holding the weapon firmly enough to provide a stable shooting platform. This is called limp wristing and is a common trait of non 1911 owners. Like most malfunctions, this can be cleared with the tap rack bang drill. Just smack the base of the magazine hard, rack the slide back and release, and bang, shoot the target. I hear another one singing out to me here. Aha. The threat has Three. studied our Three of five. detail and knows exactly where to place its <laughs> first thing is an entirely different thing, but that's a story for apart. Yeah. <laughs> they use social media right? to divide us and control Right? Us yeah. I mean no shame. No shame, right? But yeah, probably not the best story to be sharing. To the weakest Just willy -nilly. of us. While giving us the <laughs> illusion of meritocracy, we have been uh. coasting through existence with our eyes closed, and now is our last chance to awaken. Got one on the other side of this hallway, I think, right? Yep. Beep, beep. Have I popped any tapes so far? I popped one at the very beginning to to verify that that was actually a thing. And it was a thing. Um, but we're not going to be popping them until we're 100% certain that the ones we're listening to are going to be duplicates. Um, because I do like hearing them. I really like hearing them the first couple times. Like, it's interesting info. Um, 
but you can you can bet that as we repeat this section over and over, we're gonna be like, you know what, fuck it, let's just get through this. Uh, there we go. Jeez, that is hard to see, sir. Thank you. Okay. I know there's a drone here, so let's do what we need to do on this. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Days. Sorry, magazines for days. Magazines for days. Don't want to call them by the wrong term. Some people get real pissy about that. I don't. But some people do. Oh, that's a restricted one. somewhere, isn't it? Oh, it might be out on the ledge. I'm not blind jumping through there. That would be a bad idea, huh? We are all taught to carefully monitor what we put into our bodies. We need to eat this and avoid that, and have this other thing in moderation. All things in moderation. But we are never taught how to curate what we put into our minds. There's <sighs> no use having a healthy body if, if your mind is poisoned. Okay, gotta find our way oh, out of this now. has used this control to remove choice over what you consume. If you uncritically view media, you are directly no allowing get, the threat geez. to Is there no to way to get out onto that box and compromise your brain from the inside. This is how we got in here, right? And then we wormed our way around here, but then it was all busted up, all sealed up. Is there no way for us to... Mm, okay, we have to back up. back a bullet on that one. and that one too all right just gonna have to back up that's okay just be cognizant of where we stop retreading old ground and start entering into new ground I want to pop around a corner. At four out of five tapes, I don't want to pop around a corner and get immediately ventilated and then have to start over. That would be disappointing and gross. Oh, we can take the elevator down here. That's what we can do. Uh, do we have an angle on this one? We do. Sort of. A hell of a shot. Whoa, it's got an angle on us, too, huh? <laughs> oh, you little bitch. Okay, I think I did hit the ammo carrier there. So if it could... Eh, fuck it. Let's just go down there and say hello. Uh... No, oh, we can't go down there and say hello. Who puts a fucking elevator thing on here without any buttons? Damn it. Well, is there a way I can crawl down there? Looks like there's a... Alright, well, let's just keep going then. Is there a 
ladder down or something here? Here we go. Okay. Oh, well, that's blocked off anyways. Well, all right. Shit. Guess we're not going over there. Never mind. I think we might be getting into new territory now, so let's just be careful. Oh, no. There's the one we popped earlier. Okay. Well, this is blocked off, too. Well, son of a... You're really funneling me towards something, and I don't like it. I think this is where we started originally. Yeah? Okay. If that's the case, then... Yeah, it did a little little jank there for a loading zone, methinks. Oh no, that one's still done. Okay. There's a ladder up here. Hmm. Hmm, okay, yeah. There's a flyer over there. Gee. <laughs> Gee. shit. <laughs> Not dealing. Eat shit. Something was singing out to me over here. Like that. Most receivers are and that's initially tape five, isn't it? All right, let's not be stupid here. This just have a look around. Design. Don't do anything. A, a Don't do anything dumb. <laughs> Don't do anything dumb. Uh, one thing I've always been curious about: Can I shoot out these lights? I can. Just because that's fucking the first cool. One they I just never wanted to they were born into. waste the ammo if we couldn't do However, it. However, in this case, the appropriate behavior is the same. Whether you believe in the literal existence I don't know if that necessarily helps me. If like, I think they'll exist, still see me regardless of the overall light level, but body what about nothing. these? But aren't those goals inherently hmm. worthy? That's pretty cool. In this case, the means of defeating the threat are valid ends in and of themselves. We did it. We legitimately gained a rank. Up to where we were before. So, okay, at this point, if we rank down, we're just gonna insta-rank back up to this. Because F losing progress for admittedly my own fault most times. Um, we got shit to do. We got shit to do. Ooh, hey. This seems like a new one. A Beretta? I don't think we've had this one before, have we? Hopefully this has a safety on it. It does. Good, good, good. What are we limited to here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six rounds. Uh, thank you. It's like, please, <laughs> please load around, please chamber around. What the hell? Hmm. There we go. Okay. Oh, I was. What the hell's going on with this? Okay, there we go. That's safety off, yeah? That's safety on. I think. There. That was weird. Okay, safety on. Okay, that was a little bit weird. Oh! It's only at four tapes now. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't notice that before. I thought it was always at five. Hmm. That's interesting. Okay. Safety off. Aim. I think we're back, just in case. Okay. 
All right, well, let's make the most of it then. I don't think they're gonna spring anything new on us. We've already been introduced to the, the flying drones. They've done a whole lot of sleeping turrets and whatnot as well. Where is it that it's got a bead down here? Ah. Ah. Well, I knocked something off of it. I don't know if it's necessarily neutralized, though. Ouch. Oh, that fucking counted? Excuse me? Disagree. Dis a fucking agree. I disagree so much, we're just gonna skip ahead back to it. <laughs> Okay, well, now we know. Like, I knew glass hurts me. Um, I didn't know it would take me from full to zero. So, science has been done this day. Now well, this one's different, okay. Is that four rounds? Limited to four rounds here. Two, three, four, okay. That's safety on. Weird. Okay, so this one's angled a bit differently when the safety's on from the other pistols. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Let's see how much it kicks. Woo! That's got a good pop to it. Damn well, better have a good pop to it. It's the fucking Deagle. Man, they're, they're really going ham on the menacing synth. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, you want, want to start something? I dare you. I dare you to start something. Come on. Ah, uh, you coward. <laughs> uh. Oh. Really do search around for a, a hot minute, don't they? <laughs> Excellent. Can we get at least one tape out of this before we uh, meet an untimely end? Please. Like, just one. Just one before we eat shit upon our own recognizance. Just one. They got one up there, too. Ooh, they are uh, out in force now, huh? Where are you, you little shit? <laughs> I don't even think that was a particularly good shot, but it sure shredded the hell out of it. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah, this is a this is a desert eagle. At least that's what it said in the intro. It certainly feels like it is. It's got a it's got a real good kick to it. Okay, see one over there. Let's not deal with that. Point it at something and watch your troubles disappear. That's what I'm getting out of this. Now, oh, oh, that is that is a turret. Across the way here. Uh, no, no, it's behind something. Ugh. Fuck. Turret on the floor below as well. Hmm. And I assumed it was pointing at something else. Like running across behind those boxes is a bad idea too, because if it squeezes off one or two rounds, I'm toast. Watch. So I either give it a quick snapshot and hope we hit, or I turn around and go the other way. I didn't hear it unbeep. Wow, did we actually get it? Wow, nice shot! <laughs> Eat shit, idiot! Oh, incredible. Oh, something else saw us there. Oh, fuck, 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 Get you some. <laughs> Very good. Ooh, we are down to four bullets, though. Not an ideal state. We can get a couple off that, uh... Oh, nice. Wedged itself on the door frame somehow. We can get a couple from that turret we... One shot before, right? At least I hope it's a couple. Like, even one would be okay. Yeah, damn, just put one right through its eye. Oh, no, we hit the camera dead on and knocked it over. It's not fully gone yet. Okay, well, we can take care of that real quick. Bonk. Jeez. One right through the fucking eyeball. I love it. Alright. Still... Not an ideal ammo situation. Five rounds. Five rounds for five kills. Hmm. Let me see you up there. One. <laughs> huh. Oh, missed. Two. There's still one floating over there, too. God. Oh, shit. Yeah, that was a bit of a... That was a bit of a far cry, even for me. Let's see, this is where VR could come in handy. Peeking around the corners and shit. Oh, yeah, I see it. to turn around, please. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, we've got one round, huh? 
Yep. All right. Well, that's all we'll ever need. Still one over there. I hope that's a turret and not a drone. Oh, fuck. That's a drone over there. Uh, all right. I don't want to deal with you right now. You're gonna make me pop my last round into you, huh? Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, Jesus, there's a second one. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, there's a third one. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, oh, balloon, thank you. Okay. All right, it gave up. <laughs> Three rounds. You know what? I'm not going back that way. <laughs> I'm not going back that way. Shit. Something woke up. It's over there. God, there's a drone as well. Fuck me. Okay, the turret is there by the couch. I suppose there's a doorway in here, is there? Oh, shit. Alright. Ouch! Jeez, that glass has quite the radius on it. Alright, down to the one bullet again. Three bullets. There's a second turret in there somewhere. Or no, it's a drone! Bolts. Even worse, because it doesn't give me any ammo. God shit! Ah! Oh no! <laughs> Do I have any ammo left? Got one bullet. Okay, just stay out there, you fucker. Ugh. Damn it. <laughs> something. It's something. Oh, it's got one round in it. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. This thing needs to go away. Because I think it can bust through the window to get to me. Just turn, please. Thank you. Turn so I can wiggle my way upstairs and find some ammo. No, no ammo, I guess. Oh, really? Come on. Oh. All right, maybe we can sneak by it. Where did I bust in here? Over here? Over here. Ooh, doctor! Okay, that can fuck off. Oh. Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Bam! <laughs> okay, then. Great. One round. God, no ammo whatsoever, huh? And no tapes either, like what the fuck? Ugh. At least one drone floating around in the middle there. Weird though. Just on the other side. There it is. There's a turret as well. 
If I can pop that drone out of the sky, I can probably get to the turret without something. Okay, I'll have to do. Okay. Easy. Easy. Please give me some ammo. One bullet? Oh, I need more than that. <sighs> I guess that's all I'm gonna get. Good. There's a drone in there somewhere, too. There it is. F fuck, that didn't take it out. Alright, let's get you one tape. Are finally <laughs> to hear this message. Ooh. You see reality painted in shades of black, but beyond your world is another, bathed hey, in that's a, light. That's a re-recorded message from Receiver One. We have reached out to you with a warning. If you are able to hear our message, you are one of the few able to get that we can that help. Turret? We call you Receivers. The receiver who is speaking okay, these words was chosen at least because knock it out he of the sky. is able to hear us with exceptional clarity. With time, you too could oh, learn this mind tech, this. but time is not something we have. Just like that, I guess. <laughs> there is a threat to everyone on your planet, and they have been weakening your mind through your Man, media, I have a place lowering to put this your thing. natural defenses. Okay, two bullets that time. Becoming a oh, very generous. All we can do is prepare. Oh shit, that thing's still mobile? Oh crap. Fuck. <laughs> Let's make ourselves another window, that's fine. I thought the thing was disabled enough to not come near us. Ugh. That's annoying. bolts do we have? Two. Two. Two rounds. Oh, we've been skating by on one round for quite a bit, so having two is a fucking bounty. Ah. More. More. Three more, in fact. Excellent. Oh, crap. Is there a way to get down there? Mm. Maybe there's a ladder on the far side there. Oh, it's going PowerPointy. Well, we're not dealing with it in PowerPointy. No way. No way, no how. Luckily, it does save. <clears throat> When we exit manually, it does save. Crashes not so much. But we should be good to go as soon as it loads back in. <sighs> well, 
despite it going down to only four to advance to the next, like, these tapes are few and far between now. My goodness. Another one, nice. All right. All right, five more in that. Okay. I'd like to see full mag plus two and one in the chamber. Find a ladder down though. <clears throat> fuck, 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 fuck. I don't want to plug another round on this dude. Like, we already did one. That should be enough. Should have been enough. Ah, oh, there's a ladder down there. You little shit. Um, so... Let's just, uh, do this from a safe distance. So oh, it's getting jittery. Okay. 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 All right, we're good. Oh, there is either a turret or a drone in that room. Oh man, why do they put drones indoors? That's that seems unfair. <laughs> Guarding anything? Wait, what do you mean? If not... Come on, I blew the shit out of it! How is it still fucking operational? <laughs> well, now it ain't, but still. Oh, this is one we knocked out earlier. Wondering where it got off to. One for one, I guess. back over here. Watch. Well, luckily, <clears throat> I think from above we've got the advantage on these guys, right? So I don't think they can point upwards. We got stymied before because we hit that dead end and there was no way down. Okay. This time. Ooh, there is another drone indoors. Fucking. It doesn't seem fair. Wait, is that a ceiling mounted turret? Excuse me? Oh, you little shits. You little shits. Mm. I don't like that. <laughs> I really don't like that. Okay, let's drop a couple bullets for me. Thank you. Should be out and it didn't load one in the in the tank, right? Yep. Ceiling turret. You little bastards. 
complacency, yada yada yada, carry less ammo so they fire more slowly and deliberately. Does not make them less dangerous. Well, no shit. No shit, but at least we know they exist now. And we didn't, uh, take one in the face or other wares to figure that out. Amazing. Hey, look at that. To handle the extreme forces of the 50 caliber Action Express cartridge, the Desert Eagle is designed more like a compact AR-15 than like a traditional pistol, uh, with a rotating locking bolt and a gas-operated piston. It is significantly more mechanically accurate than comparable revolvers, and achieves higher muzzle velocities uh, because it can handle higher pressures and uses no energy to a cylinder gap. True the Desert enough. Eagle also reduces recoil by bleeding some of that energy into the auto-loading mechanism and solves the Magnum Revolver's problem of bullets creeping forwards under recoil. On the other hand, it is much heavier yeah, and shit, more Shit, it's much heavier. It's a fucking 50 caliber pistol. It's more finicky about ammo. Gravy. The gas piston can easily be fouled with powdered lead if the bullet has an unjacketed base. And if you don't have a tight enough grip, the rotating bolt tends to twist the gun just right to fling hot brass right into your face. But, but if you really need the power of a rifle and the form factor of a pistol, the Desert Eagle is the firearm for you. Jeez. Ridiculous. Um, mm, that's not good. <laughs> Parks himself right outside the doorway where I need to go. Sir, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. I guess this is the opposite side of it, huh? Looks identical to where we just came from. Right? Yeah. Yeah, because that door was open. Yeah, okay. Mm. Woo! Boy, that was a, a bit of a questionable shot. We got him. God, there's another one in there, too. And probably a turret on the <clears throat> bottom ledge. Oh no, okay, so we knocked it out of the sky. It's still active. And there's a turret in the corner there, and where's the... Oh, oh Jesus! Okay. Need to find where the drone is before we worry about... Oh, there it is. Bonk! Okay. Should we down to like four or five rounds now? Okay, that's all right. That one was probably doomed from the beginning, from the fucking just absolute lack of ammo. Wild lack of ammo. It's already fully packed. Safety on the Glock 17, that seems bad. But it does do full auto, I think, is what we had run into a little bit before. Seems like an incredibly bad waste of ammo. Wow. 
Well, that thing's gone. Seem to be sending a higher proportion of drones over turrets now, which is problematic because we get most of our ammo from turrets. Oh boy. Oh, well, speaking of, there's a turret. We could just, uh, ooh, there's a drone over there too. Son of a. a good position for this. I don't have a flashlight either, so we can't ID a good spot. Jesus, on the turret to blow away first. Okay, maybe we should get the attention of that drone. Get into a, an ideal position. That would have been fucking sick if the turret got rid of our drone problem here. I don't know that that did anything. thought there was a box on the front there that we had... There we go. Oh, there's a second one. Uh, oh, that's the one we just <laughs> capped off. Alright, very good then. Effectively neutralized. Don't have to worry about them, other than the noise. Mm. Mm, um, okay, not sure how you saw me through metal and concrete there, buddy, but... Come get you some, I guess. Damn it, and then it hard crashed! Receiver 2, please! God damn it. I just want to play this game! <laughs> please, let me play this game. We're finally doing it such that we're taking the right amount of caution in traversing these areas, and then the game is just like, nah, fuck you. Fuck you, I'm a crash. I'm like, alright, I guess. <sighs> so where did that pop me back to? Are we at the start of this area now again? I guess we are. Gave me a... Glock 17 with an unloaded mag. <laughs> it's still a threat, isn't it? 
not anymore, it ain't. Fuck you. Mm. Hilarious. that we had any tapes before it crashed anyway, so it's probably fine. Used one bullet there. Not four. Ugh. Throwing in a turret. Ceiling turret. That's why I couldn't see it on the ground. You bastards. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, slower and more considered shots, huh? Yeah, well, it considered it right into my chest. Very good, then. Yeah, damn it. the deagle. Powerful gun for powerful people. Is that a normal ass turret just sitting there? Wow, amazing. Oh, well. Well. Squeeze off two rounds that I didn't need, I guess. Damn it. Let's see that there's a drone up above, too. Do this quick. Yeah. Pop. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Ow.
People hating the D-ranking mechanic. Yeah, it's... I don't feel too good about it either, to be honest with you. Not one of my most favorite ways to, uh, to gate progress. leave it be as long as it doesn't bother us. Very careful about our ammo usage. You use technology to control physical things. Now, similarly, there is mind tech, which is used to control the boundless luminescence. Mind tech can be used for good or evil. And the threat has been using its mind tech as a weapon against you. And so far has okay. caused widespread sickness and mental weakness. Uh, elevator up, it looks like. Then. Now that you are in a helpless state, they are readying a crippling nope, not taking blow. an elevator up. So there ain't no kill. buttons. But they are aware that will not work on you. They have another potent weapon they will bring to bear against receivers called the Dreaming. They cannot exist fully in here. this reality, but Elevator they have buttons over here and experimenting in yeah, their look at that. This new mind tech. The Dreaming is a bridge from our world to yours, and they will use this bridge to send specially conceived of weapons designed to work in your environment nope. Top, I guess. these automatic weapons are designed to kill the few who survive one of four the gravy okay. oh the we've been here did we take the elevator down Okay. Clear line of sight. No? Okay. Mm. something else over there. Maybe that was the only thing, though. Ooh, nope. There's a turret.
shot. There we go. Ow! What? Uh. Uh. Skipping anything in any side areas here, just in case. We found the one tape like 10 minutes ago. Which, honestly, the longer each round goes, the more likely we are to crash the game and lose everything. So, maybe we should treat this a bit more urgently. can't go too fast, because otherwise we risk dunking ourselves right into a trap or something. Of a bitch, there's a turret up there, really? That's oh, it's a ceiling dillabop. Well, not dealing with this. There. There's two of them. Oh, that's super. Oh, that's not good. a drone off to the left, huh? Yep, surely is. Come on, buddy. Meg's empty. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! <laughs> okay. Golly. <laughs> Giving me a heart attack. I knew there was another turret or something down here, wasn't there? I was worried about just running willy-nilly into something. I guess not. Okay, well we definitely need to get the ammo from those two turrets we popped before. I know, the game is really good. Like, it just needs to behave. And we'll be set for hours, but... Ugh. The fact that it just seems to crash on a... Oopsie. Seems to crash on a whim is... Troublesome. Okay, 
this one more. It sounds like a turret rather than a, a drone, though. Ceiling mounted. Oh, and there's another one off to the left as well. Alright, you can't see me from... Okay, good. Okay. There's another one over there. Okay. No tapes out of any of that. Ridiculous. The fuck are they all hiding? Heard anything sing out to me in a damn long time. There's another looks like a ceiling mounted turret. Yep. Putting a whole heck of a lot of these into play now. No magazine run, holy shit. Chamber one at a time and throw away all the ma- Jesus. Why? <laughs> but why? <laughs> I mean, I get it. I guess people like super extra challenge. And I would definitely be down for that, but I'm just trying to get through it the first time. Gravy. turret there. I think there's one over there. Or is that a drone? That is a drone. It's all fucking erratic and shit. Okay. Well, let's see. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to get the ammo out of that one, so... Mm. Finally. Oh, there is a second one around here somewhere. Is that a drone? Must be. It's pretty erratic. Drone no more. <laughs> Every single day is the worst. Day oh of crap, my crap, life. crap, 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 crap. It just keeps getting worse and worse. <sighs> okay. Every day I step over junkies and, and human waste on my way to my third job just to make a, a dent in my mountain of debt. Okay. We're good. The planet is dying. We're fine. The rich. The rich own Maybe everything. Wrong. We keep killing each other for no reason. I'm ashamed to be a part of this world. I give up. Nope. <laughs> nope. It's a big old nope on that one. Safe for now.
Oh, really? Can't slip on through here, huh? Ah, fuck. Okay, well... Hmm. We do have enough of an angle on it. We could quick pop one. But we've got to be extremely quick. Ooh! Okay. A whole lot of time to do this. Do it. There. We can't even reach it. You. Well, maybe we can actually. Oh, it did drop one for us, anyways. Good. This building, this okay, this one's fine. Place, it doesn't make much sense. Like wh while I know this isn't the same room as before, it still feels familiar. It's more like a, a fictional place than the real world. It's oh, it's like someone made copies of of copies and, and lost the original intent of. All the objects. Oh boy. Okay. Shit, 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 shit. Ah, oh, why did I try to run back? That was dumb. Ah, uh, we are three or four. That was my stupid dumb fault. But I'm still not going to accept the D rank. <laughs> uh, fuck. Then they give me the damn snub nose. Ah, uh, ah, uh, well. Maybe, at the very least, we'll get more ammo. Oh, two block chambers, great. Counterclockwise. <sighs> okay, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. That, that one was my own dumb idiot fault. So I, I can accept that, but at the very least, I'm gonna try to knock out this rank tonight and then return next time. Ladder down on the side there is. Okay. Oh, normal ass turret, excuse me. It's very What? Really? Oh, I okay, I guess I kinda deserve that. <laughs> I guess I did kind of deserve that. Discharged it awful close to where I was. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay.
drone and turret. And probably something else over there. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Two turrets. Two drones. But! <laughs> okay. I thought I would be able to outrun that. But not quite. Not quite. Not quite, not quite, not quite. Not quite, not quite, not quite. Alright, what do we got? course with this though like it's a fun enough game where I will put up with these shenanigans because this is fun and interesting and cool Okay, I was about to say, did I lose sound effects again for no particular reason? No. No, we did not. Uh, uh, uh. The hell was that? Oh, did it land on some outcropping? It just kind of went wild for a little bit? Yeah, alright. Well, it's gonna... Eventually wiggle itself off that little thin piece of metal, I think. We'll, we'll leave it to its own devices there. poking around in the dark. Shit. You little 
bitch. Sing out to me. Ooh. Thank you. Mm. While waiting for the other branches to agree on the requirements for the new M9 pistol, the Air Force decided to conduct their own trials, and decided on the Beretta 92. Uh, all done, right? Wrong. The Army rejected the Air Force testing, claiming the Flyboys had no idea how to properly test reliability in mud and sand. The Army was perfectly <clears throat> happy with their 1911s, so when they conducted their own trials, they found that none of the new pistols were good enough, and tried to shut the whole program down. The Air Force still wanted their new pistols, and got the DoD to force the Army to conduct yet another test, and choose something. After further testing, the Army reluctantly admitted that the Beretta 92 and the Sig Sauer 226 might be adequate. Now, the SIG scored better, but Beretta named a lower Fucking price and won the contract. It's a bunch of... After seven years and millions... Bunch of people waving dollars, their dicks around. The US Honestly, is what it is. ...the service pistol, the Beretta M9. Uh, the U.S. also got three more years of congressional investigations to determine how we managed to screw this whole thing up so badly. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. Bunch of fucking EPN measurements and whatever is what it's about, really. <clears throat> okay, just kind of backtracked on our on ourselves there a little bit. Was there another path out of here? Ah, yeah. Went through a Steam thread about people experiencing crash in several Linux distros. Oh, okay. Uh, if you wouldn't mind, please uh, slam that thread in a Discord somewhere so I can take a peek at it. Maybe you can glean some info. So I do oh, shit. <laughs> what was I thinking on that one? Oh, boy. So I did do a bit of cursory searching about it this morning, but I didn't find anything conclusive. Fuck! Jesus, they really get on your case for a long time, don't they? Damn. Motherfuckers. Oi. Damn fucking drone. I'm posted a workaround. Oh, good. Good. I will take a peek at that later tonight and see if we can get that in line for next time. Because, boy, howdy, if I didn't have to deal with the three or four crashes a night and having to quit out and reset it for PowerPoint mode, etc., etc., that would be, that'd be real good. Figuring we could maybe hit a flow every now and again. Oh, fuck. I did not chamber around. Good job. Okay. Oh! <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, we'll we'll shoot some glass when we come back. We'll sh we'll shoot the glass. <laughs> of course, they spawn us nowhere near glass. Neat, neat and awesome. All right, we'll find some glass real quick and test this out. Does this, does this count? Four, five, five shots of glass and then a hard crash. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, well, one's an anomaly, two is a pattern, so let's try that again. Let's do it again. Hmm. Actually got bullets here. It's really pointed directly at this. Okay, thank you. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, out of ammo. Hmm. A lot, of, a lot more glass happening here, and nothing bad seems to have befallen us. Maybe it's because the glass before was over kind of an open area of the of the world, so it never like hit the ground and, and stopped doing its shit, right? No. Could could be a great many things. Could be a great many things, but yeah, we'll figure it out eventually, maybe. <sighs> okay. What the fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, wrong button. Thought ah, shit. <laughs> Panic, pull from holster, shoot self in leg, get zapped in back of head. Very good. <coughs> oh, God. Good. Good job. Good job. Good job. Fucking, oh, there was a... Fucking... <sighs> this fucking game. Like, I get it. I, I think it's kind of cool that they start you out at, uh, at kind of in a different status each time. Like, sometimes there's a round in the chamber, sometimes the mag is in your hand or whatever. Ah, uh, but boy howdy. When you fudge it up right at the start, doesn't feel good. Doesn't feel great. Yeah, come on, come through that door. <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> Get you some. That was a pretty good fucking moon shot there. Gotta 
turret and a drone up there somewhere. Ceiling mounted? No, normal. We shot ourselves at the Deagle yet? I don't think so. We've uh, remained curiously unself injured by the Deagle. Can we? <laughs> no, we're not even gonna. Not even gonna. There. You are finally prepared <sighs> to hear this message. Hear this message. Something, you something. See shades of black. In shades of black. But beyond your world is another, bathed in radiant light. We have reached out to you with a warning. If you are able to hear our message, you are one of the few that we can help. We call you receivers. The receiver who is speaking these words was chosen because he is able to hear us with exceptional clarity. With time, you too could learn this mind tech, but time is not something we have. There is a threat to everyone on your planet, and they have been weakening your mind through your media, lowering your natural defenses. The coming attack is unavoidable. All ah. we can do is prepare. Worth it. We're gonna get 17 rounds. Sing out to me. We need three more. Bingo. Aside from the polymer <laughs> frame, the Glock's most controversial design choice is the lack of external safety switch. No the shit, lack of external safety. Internal safeties. Jesus. Glock made this decision because Austrian soldiers carried pistols with an empty chamber, making a safety switch redundant. Well, not everybody American carries pistols with an empty chamber. Around chambered. After adopting the Glock, there was an epidemic of Americans accidentally oh, shooting shit. themselves and each other. The FBI Academy performed a study and found that the Glock pistol has, quote, high potential for unintentional shots. Balls. Glock always points out that the internal safety features guarantee that the weapon will never fire unless the trigger is pulled. Well, fucking dog. <laughs> God oh, damn it! That. Time, it's it. their own damn yeah. fault. Negligent discharges are a training problem and not a design problem. <sighs> the one thing that everyone agrees on is that loaded Glock pistols should only be carried with an appropriate holster and with sufficient training. You shouldn't keep a loaded Glock in the front of your waistband unless you really need help hitting those high notes. Ah, I get it. Because you'd shoot yourself in the dick. That's what they're getting at, I think. Wait, what the fuck? Did it not follow me through, like, those three rooms? Oh, wow. Okay. Managed to wedge itself right there.
like so. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> mm. It's a good game. It's a good game. I'm just bad at it. <laughs> oh, get vaporized. Holy shit. Some receivers Amazing. believe the message, but are Amazing. the source themselves. Uh, we have developed a mind tech called Clear Tape to aid you in your receiving. This is another repeat from receiver one. Your subconscious mind has been eroded by dangerous, addictive media. To wean you from this addiction, we will train your mind a conditioned response to your advantage. I guess that's what a 50 cal round will do. External cues. Clear Good tape gravy. provides a way to reduce the symptoms of media damage. Good but you gravy. will have been issued a clear tape. Put the tape into your tape deck <clears> and press play. At first, it is normal to only hear background static. After several sessions, you may hear a voice. <laughs> Made it all the way over there. Amazing. Oh, oh. Your crude world is not the true reality. Your physical body here is the shadow cast by your transcendent Ooh, mind. Boy. We call this higher plane reality A and your world of shadows reality B. If you're receiving this message in a fictional context, you are at an even deeper level. Uh, one okay. that we can It didn't bust reach. through the outer glass there? Which is kind of strange. Your body is a shadow of your mind. When your mind mm. dies, your body will vanish. In the normal oh. order of your world, <laughs> a transition fuck. in which your mind is set free. Oh, fuck. But for victims, <laughs> Okay. Fuck. How did it was? Wasn't it outside the glass? Did it bust through and I didn't hear it? Doesn't matter. It's done. <laughs> It did bust through! It didn't make a noise! What the fuck? That should have made, like, the biggest noise! Look at that shit! Ah. Don't need that heart attack! Get out of here! Ugh. Fuck.
Good golly. <sighs> Ooh, nice. Three more rounds. Beautiful. Hmm. <laughs> I just love no matter what I hit on this with this 50 cal, it's just like no, nah, it's it's fucking toast. It's toast. Just toast. Problem be gone. All right, two more to go, two more to go. Sing out to me, please. Give me a sign, give me a hint. Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, that we made any gains there. <clears throat> Super Canadian question on determines the caliber, the size of the bullet. Yes, yes, the caliber is the um, the diameter of the slug of the bullet. So, the higher the caliber, the larger the slug that gets propelled out. I think that's what it is. It might be just the, the full cartridge itself, or it might just be the slug on the end. I don't know. I couldn't tell you for sure, but yes, it is directly related to size. And I couldn't tell you exactly what that size means. Since this is a, a 50 cal or a 0.5 caliber, I don't know if that means like half inch or something. Because half inch would be really fucking big. It very well might be half inch, actually. Yeah. I don't know. You'd have to look up the exact conversion for that. But I think it's it might actually be a half inch for 50 cal. Okay. All right. We got a turret. Ceiling turret there. Do I have a... I do have a flashlight. Okay. Uh... Fuck, 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 fuck. I heard something beep at me. That's not good. Oh. Okay, that must have been a drone, because it did take its sweet time and unbeeping at us. on the outside. Okay. Let's be careful of this. Ooh, dear. Okay, there's one down there. There's one outside. Yep. Mm-hmm. Keep it going on through. Thank you. There's a turret on the ceiling. Is there a normal-ass turret out there, too? Oh, no, that's a ceiling turret. Whoop, bonk. Okay, there you are. Shit, that was the drone, wasn't it? Yeah, it's going wild trying to get to me. Okay. Not a good... Not a 
good mix of things to be after us. Oh, there's a normal ground ass turret too. Ooh, that's kind of distressing. There. Okay. Yep. Drone outside. Just crashed on through. Fuck. 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 Back off. Let it come to us. Come on, bitch. I dare you. <laughs> I dare you. Oh no! <laughs> Fuck! Ah oh, shit! Yeah, there you go. It's pretty much instant kill. When I fucking eat shit on my own damn 50 cal there. Ah, god damn it. <laughs> science. Fucking science, man. Fucking science. Fucking science. That's the only way. That's the only way things can go, you know. You, sometimes you just gotta science. You just gotta science. Willing or not. Willing or not, you just got a science. Oops, did I, uh, what did I just do there? Okay, that is chambered. It is full, okay. Very good, man. Oh, there's bullets right behind us on the toilet. Cause that's where I keep my bullets, right? It's on the toilet, just in case. You never know. You never know. Better safe than sorry, right? Fuck. <sighs> Alright, it's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I think... Oh, it is getting kind of late, so we'll probably make this the last go of things for tonight. Of course, there's no chance of giving me a, a free tape in our starting area, huh? No, why would we want to do that? Mm -hmm. Pop. Oh, damn. Well, that thing definitely took a hit somewhere. It's having some trouble navigating. Whoa. Oh, oh, kind of... Kind of... Unjammed itself somehow there. Not gonna waste another bullet on it though. So. Oh, maybe we should. Maybe we should. Oh, it's having having a real trouble with its yaw there. There. <laughs> okay. All right. A receiver is said to be awake when he is able to get a completely clear signal free of any subconscious corruption. In this state, he will be Ooh, able to see the in their true form and transcend normal human limitations. Mm. Although some of the receivers we chose to speak through are advanced in their ability, no human has yet achieved this awakened state. Mm. Humans exist in two worlds. In reality B, they live and work in their shadow bodies. In reality A, they are asleep. Their minds are concerned. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I thought there was more balcony over there. Oops. God damn it. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, I thought there was going to be more floor outside. Damn it, and then the snub nose. We're ending this on the snub nose, huh? All right. Very good, then. No blocked up chambers this time. Five spare rounds. Mm -hmm. 
be able to sneak around that. Shot a little bit too high there. Last go of things for real. Hmm. There's a drone up there. Oh, two of them. <laughs> Shit. Fuck, it's empty. chambering around. Okay.
<laughs> ah. No? This tape is Jeez. designed to I test your invisible. focus in Great. the face of distraction. Oh, Maintain what the? focus on your breathing. How did you do? If your attention wandered, that is normal. Just notice that without judgment. Let's try again. Good job. Thanks. <laughs> All right, 104. Easy peasy. Ceiling turret there, huh? shooting out the glass causing a crash or something, right? Wait for it to rotate on around. I don't know what I was thinking there. I didn't think it had the angle to get to me there. All right. <laughs> okay, let's just re-advance rank and then we'll call it. And then we'll call it and resume this next time. <laughs> now that we have uh, permanently enough slapped ourselves into the, the sleepwalker rank here. My goodness. My goodness, my goodness. All right, we'll call it a night there. Uh, I've had a bit of a schedule change coming up this week, so no stream tomorrow, uh, which would normally would have been a Shmup Book Club. Uh, had something come up, so no stream tomorrow. Um, podcast is still on for Friday night, though. 7 p.m. CST, twitch.tv slash zero productions. Talk about video games, news, what we've been playing, and we do some design at the end. It's always really fun. Uh, and then Saturday, we are also off. Got something else going on there. Uh, but we'll be back again on Sunday, 7 p.m. CST. We'll be going back to CrossCode again uh, because of the new home DLC. We're just starting to get into it. Uh, we'll see how long that uh, holds for us. And then next week, Monday, 7 p.m. CST, we'll be back here with Receiver 2, hopefully with a workaround in place so we get fewer crashes or fewer slowdowns or, or you know, whatever. We'll, we'll figure something out. We'll figure something out. Uh, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you on Friday. Bye-bye.